Hello, in this video, I would like to show you how to upgrade this uh, ProFace uh, HMI from CCFL to our UB series LED kits. This kit comes with the one uh, LSR series, strips, LED driver, aluminum foil. Okay, let's take a look at this. Uh, this is made by, it's kind of small, really difficult to see. A little bit tricky to see it. It's actually made by uh, ProFace. The model is 288045-02. Okay, so first of all, this is up front, ProFace. And then uh, there's a few screws, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven screws needs to be replaced and removed. Then in order to remove these covers. Okay, last one's out. Basically, you just tear it up like this. I show you. Because on this side, there's a whole bunch of plastic latch. So you have to tear up like this, push it. So it's out. So this is the power supply. This is one, two, three. There's three more screws holding the chassis. After we unscrew it, we can pull up and take a look at what kind of inverter is it, what type of screen connection is. Okay, so basically, you're gonna pull like this. Okay, put it back like this. So as you see, this is the inverter. This is the screen. And it looks like the screen, we the, this is the back line. It looks like we don't have to hold. There's two options. Either you will not do, you try to do the perfect jobs, which is, I mean, disassemble, disassemble the whole thing, take it out and, and do this in showing. And, but I will prefer the shortcuts. So basically, you just need to have disconnected. There's one screw holding the back line assemblies. Okay, I'll show you. You unscrew it, just grab the wire, just like this. See this? Oh. Video totally. So basically, this is what we do. Let me disconnect our LED key from the dryer first. See, you just put it back right like this. So put it back like this, and then you just all you need to do just cure this element foil, tape on the top, right? Remove inverter. This one. Tape this a. Uh, Mount it back to the same location, and that's it. It's quite easy, you see. You take this one out, put it here. You align with this this pin, okay? Align with the wire, the one with the wire one, because I we already using this eight pin. Okay, you just mount back like this. Just connect two, and then we can uh, fire up. So just just like this. I cleaned that already, so just put it like this. Okay, peel off this aluminum foil. Just tape it in between. Yep. Use a towel. Just make sure you stick to it. Okay, then you remove uh, this inverter board here. Okay. Okay, take it out. You clean here a little bit because we're gonna mount it back. Peel off this tip. Here's the cut. And then we can stick the same locations. Connect the back right here. So here I would like to add a piece of tips, just like this to secure this wires here. Right? Okay, it's done. So we're gonna put it back, put the screw back, everything back, and we're gonna test it. So we just put the back cover in, put the screen to hold the chassis, put certain screw back here, and then I also connect a 24 volt here, positive, negative. So let's take a look. I'm gonna shut off the overhead light. And uh, just shut, turn it on. It's on. Okay. 
Well, I'll take a couple seconds, couple minutes, um, a couple few seconds to put it up. Japanese. Okay, see how easy it is? Thank you for watching.